All right, back here at home into politics now. Republican presidential candidate Nikki Haley on the defensive tonight for what she left out when she was asked about the causes of the Civil War. Brian Nobles has this one. Tonight, Republican presidential candidate Nikki Haley in cleanup mode after leaving out slavery as a root cause of the Civil War during a town hall in New Hampshire on Wednesday. What do you want me to say about slavery? No, um, uh, you can answer my question. Thank you. Next question. Haley spent Thursday attempting to explain what she meant. Of course the Civil War was about slavery. And make clear the role slavery played in American history. We know the Civil War was about slavery. But it was also more than that. It was about the freedoms of every individual. Her opponents seized on the comments. President Joe Biden responding, quote, it was about slavery and GOP rival Ron DeSantis arguing she isn't ready for the big stage. The minute that she faces any type of scrutiny, uh, she tends to cave. As governor of South Carolina, Haley pushed for the removal of a Confederate flag on display on the Capitol grounds after a mass shooting at a black church in Charleston, carried out by a white supremacist. It's time to move the flag from the Capitol grounds. She made that decision after intense pressure by African-American leaders in the wake of the massacre. The firestorm comes as Haley is gaining ground on the clear frontrunner, former President Donald Trump. Trump has routinely used divisive rhetoric and recently made racist comments about migrants and minority groups. They're poisoning the blood of our country. That's what they've done. But Trump's controversial words have done little to change the trajectory of the race. And these comments come at a make or break moment for the Haley campaign, with polls showing Donald Trump leading by more than double digits and just 18 days to go before Iowa and less than 30 days before New Hampshire. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.